everyone and welcome to this video. Today I'm going to talk about how to conceal dark and dry circles. So first you're going to need a few products and the first one is the Bobbi Brown Corrector. Now this is like a really really thick concealer and you put it in your eyes so it just pretty much covers up all dark circles. There's different colours of it so if you're going to get it um, you need to make sure you get the right colour ready for your skin tone and it's got a little cute mirror in there as well so that's always handy. I find it lasts all day though so I don't really take it with me anywhere, I don't need to take it in my bag. I just put on the morning and it lasts all day, so yeah. So with this product, what you want to do is just warm up a bit on your finger. And I use my ring finger because it's the most delicate one. And then you just lightly touch and stroke in your inner eye. And if you're going to go underneath, go really close to the lash line. If you go down here, it's going to crease loads. So I'm going to do one eye and leave the other one without anything on it. So now I've done that, I'm going to use my NYX HD Photogenic Concealer in CW01 and just dab that under my eye. Then I'm going to take my Real Techniques Stippling Brush and just blend in, kind of using sweeping motions and little circles as well. So this is obviously the one I've done and this one I haven't and that's just how I quickly conceal under eye circles in the morning. It's quite a quick method, there's not too many products involved. I know the Bobbi Brown corrector is quite expensive, I think it's about £18. Um, but I really like it actually, I didn't like it to start with, I wasn't really sure how to use it. But it's important to warm it up on your finger, I wouldn't use a brush. And only put a tiny bit on as well, less is more because the more you put on the more it's just going to crease. So then I settle that with the MAC Prep and Prime Translucent Finishing Powder. And I use that just on an unbranded small powder brush. And just put a light layer under my eyes. And that's done. It's the finished look. And it just stops it creasing or um, kind of like just going all horrible and stuff it just kind of sets it in place and keeps it nice and flat and um, just keeps it on really so you definitely need to set it you don't necessarily need the MAC powder you can use any powder but it's quite good to use a light one or a translucent one because you obviously want to highlight under your eyes a little bit thanks for watching and if you want to see any more of my videos then please subscribe it's completely free and if you like this video then please hit like and I'll see you in the next one bye